Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, and welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having a beautiful day. So today is my graduation vlog. I didn't think I was going to vlog it, but I kind of feel like it would be a waste. Like I filmed so many uni vlogs that I've got to film the last one, you know, and it'll be lovely to look back on in years to come. So today is the day before my graduation. It's actually my boyfriend's graduation today. So I've just sat and watched his in Logie Lecture Theatre. Um, so for anybody in the future who's coming for graduations, you only get two complimentary tickets and then you have to buy extra on top of that. But they're really hard to get a hold of. So you have to be on it like at the specific time that they come out and they're 25 pound each per extra ticket. Um, so it was my boyfriend's graduation today and his family are all here for it and it's great and it's so lovely. Um, and I came on campus for pictures with him just to celebrate with him. Um, and so actually it's great that they have the live stream on in Logie Lecture Theatre because if you're on campus kicking them out, you come for pictures, but then you maybe don't have a ticket, then I would definitely recommend. I'm sure they probably do that every year. So I have just finished watching him um, with his graduation, there's obviously the ceremony still going on, but he was quite early on because he was sports science. So um, I'm just going to kick about for a bit. But yeah, I am so excited. It feels a little bit surreal, like it doesn't feel real. I can't believe that my time in Sterling is up. I'm so excited to go on to study further and study theology at um, Miss You Day, which is affiliated with the University of Chester, but it'll be exciting. Now I can honestly say that my time at Stirling has honestly just been the best. Obviously two years were a little bit bizarre because of COVID, but I wouldn't change it for the world. And I've actually, you know, I met Jesus here. I've had, I met amazing people here. I need to pull this door. But yeah, like I would not change it for the world and I've had the best time. I'm a little bit sad to be leaving, but at least I still get to carry on living in Stirling. So yeah, I will at some point do a review of my time at Sterling in depth, obviously focusing on French and Spanish, but um, I will try and make it as generic as possible. But I will show you in like the atrium where all the graduate graduates like come to, to gather. Um, and then tomorrow I'll probably show you by the sports center and where it all happens. Sophie Louise Dodd. So the makeup's off, the hair has gone up in a bun and I'm in my comfies again. And it's been such a long day, but it's just been amazing. Like it's been so lovely to celebrate with family and friends who are like family. And it's just really making me feel so grateful for my time at Sterling. You know, like I came to Sterling and like, if you've been here from the start or if you've seen the very first vlogs of me moving in, I came to Sterling such a different person than what I'm leaving. And I'm so grateful for every single lecturer I've had, every single person that's shaped the person I am today. And you know, I wanna give particular mention to Ben and Angie Thorpe. Like they have been fundamental in the way that I've changed throughout my time at Sterling. I met Ben in my second year at uni. He started out and he was, you know, trying to help out the the swim team um, and trying to step his foot in as a sports chaplain and, and like help people to, to just, you know, he's a mental health mentor at uni, help people with their mental health. And, and I really came to uni really struggling mentally. Um, and I've been very open with that on my channel before and, and that shouldn't really come as a surprise unless you're new to the channel. But I came to uni in first year, a broken little girl. Like I was broken, I was suicidal, I was depressed, I was anxious. I was, I actually began to self-harm my first year at uni. And actually for me to, to actually like 
think about it, how much Jesus has changed my life. Like I met Jesus at Sterling and that will never change. And I'm so, so grateful, but also just the, the people I've met, like, ugh, it's just been such a blessing. And I just really want to thank God for that. Like, I just want to thank God for how much I have changed. I came such a broken little girl and Jesus has healed me piece by piece. And now I have an inheritance that's secured in heaven. And it actually makes me a little emotional because I'm just a totally different person. Like, if you look at my eyes from those old videos, I looked so dead. And now I'm just so alive. I'm so happy. I'm so joyful because joy comes from Jesus. And actually, like, it's just such a, it's just been such a, a ride. Like, it's been so, so, it's such an up and down time. Like, it's been such a roller coaster. Like, I've really had the highest highs at Sterling, but I've also had the lowest lows. Glandular fever was such a low having COVID was really hard in my fourth year while trying to write a dissertation. It's just been such a ride, but I wouldn't change it for the world because it's just made me who I am. And I'm so, so grateful to Sterling University for the journey that I've had and that will never, ever change. And it will always, always be such a great memory. So if you are watching this, considering going to Sterling University, I would definitely recommend it. The campus is amazing. The people are amazing. Just the community is just beautiful. And I think like something that's always struck me about Sterling from the very first time I came here from for my open day was the community of Sterling. Like you walk into town, you're always going to bump into a student. But I also want to say if you graduated this year as well, then congratulations. Well done. Be so, so proud of what you've achieved. But yeah, just remember your time at Sterling with, with so much joy and so much happiness. And yeah, I hope that this video has been uh, somewhat insightful into what graduation is like at Sterling. Um, and yeah, I hope that you've enjoyed coming um, coming along with me. Um, I will probably film a video reviewing my entire time at Sterling. But um, yeah, the Sterling Uni vlogs are coming to a close and a new chapter is coming and I'm very excited. Um, I don't know if I've said already, I will be going to study uh, theology and Christian leadership at Miss You Day College. Um, it's a Bible college, but it's affiliated with the University of Chester. So I will be getting another Bachelor of Arts. Um, and yeah, I'm so excited for this new chapter. It's going to be such a difference, but I'm so, so excited. So yeah, stay tuned for more videos from me. There'll probably be a little bit of sport, a little bit of lifestyle, a little bit of college so a uh, university um so yeah i hope that you've enjoyed this video and stay safe guys god bless i hope that you had an amazing day today bye